Hey everybody, uh, welcome to another episode of Let's Open Some Packs. Uh, today, uh, I'm talking about some Hanafuda cards, but not these, uh, these, this deck. You might have seen this deck popping up around everywhere. Um, and I got this deck through points through the playingcards.com. I think it's playingcards.com. Yeah, th th there's like a, there's a lot of online shops, right? And one of the, some of them do points. And uh, I had a ton of points, and I'm, <laughs> as you can imagine. And uh, they're like, you can get a free deck. And I saw these, and I was like, huh, those are cool. And this is before they started advertising them, uh, which they're everywhere now. Like, there's a gilded one. There's a stripper version of this. Um, and there's a regular version. Um, I haven't seen the regular version too much. I've been seeing the regular version sell out. Uh, but there's still stripper and uh, gilded. Uh, yeah, but these are based, I believe, on Hanafuda cards, and I brought a deck here. Uh, oh, I should have opened this before I started the video. <laughs> I'm so sorry. But then you can hear me chat, because I wanted to talk about how why I'm interested in this. Uh, so if you don't know what Hanafuda cards are, they're these little Japanese um, uh, playing cards that were... There's a whole story there, and it's actually a pretty small blurb. You can go on... Um, on Wikipedia or in, or anywhere and, and find how uh, they used to gamble and then they became like illegal um, and then uh, they just kept trying to find different ways to gamble <laughs> so they were like making these cards uh, and I think they came from Portugal um, where the Portuguese like brought the games to Japan uh, in the early early like uh, like 1300 like a long time ago and uh, they kept finding like abstract ways of uh, making these game, these card games, and then later on, um, these cards were definitely illegal. Uh, but the, the the ones they were trying to do with gambling, um, they uh, they kept changing the art. And then Nintendo came along, so these are Nintendo ones. Uh, and oh, and I did a video on these uh, on two two of these decks. Uh, there's more. Um, I only got two. I think I only have two, and they're really interesting. Um, and yeah, and I'll show you some real quick. I, I, I wanted to show you these first so you understand where it comes from. And just so it's, because this to the, to the, to a random person, this might just look like a bird with trees, <laughs> you know, or like, okay, yeah, that's just a thing. But no, there's a lot of like history there uh, with the Hanafuda. And I think it's very interesting. And yeah, it's not just uh, this, like, this is so abstract, right? Um, so someone will be like, what is, what is that? Who cares? Oh, I'm looking, there's a sparrow. Um, but yeah, so I wanted to show you these and you can watch the video where I go through them and I talk a little bit more about the history, but it's a really interesting history and how Nintendo got involved. Uh, and I wanted to also look at these and kind of compare the art uh, when I open them. So yeah, and Japan is my dream vacation. Uh, I was actually starting to plan a trip, kind of, like loosely, you know? Um, I watch a lot of those YouTube videos, you know, where people go there and they like eat food and stuff or they'll go visit, they'll go to video game shops or they'll go to like, oh, that came off surprisingly fast. Um, but yeah, anyways, I want to go there really bad. Um, and then the world kind of shut down for a while. So, uh, oh yeah, it is playingcarddecks.com. Oh, this might be one of their decks. Um, they make their own decks, uh, which is cool. Hey, if that, if that's what it is, then, uh, there you go. Look, uh, this video is not advertised. Or whatever you call it um i just like the deck and i got it for from for with using my points yeah so this is a stand i know this is a classic stock um and they're designed by let me bring up the artist i wanted to actually give props this time proper going a little blind but not too blind um the the designer is juniardi satan satan yanagra yanagara sat sat i can't say that I'm really sorry. Um, yeah, but this design <laughs> produced by Will Roya. That's a lot easier to say. Uh, but the, the, uh, this designer, uh, or this designer, this, um, oh, there's only 200 guild, gilded. US, okay, cool. Yeah, this, uh, what was I saying? Oh, Japan. I kind of went all over the place there. Let, let's do this first. Let's look at the, let's look at the tuck. The name threw me off. <laughs> like saying it like, oh man. Ugh, how embarrassing. Look at that. That's a cool back design. These are going to fan really pretty, I bet. Um, looks like a standard tuck, too. Nothing uh, nothing too fancy. Um, just a standard tuck. 
from USPCC. They they uh, they tuck. You can a lot of times when you see these other tucks, these like nice and boss and things like that. They uh, yeah, it's it's just it's a standard tuck. They get those done special outside. Oh, and there's no borders. I did not know that. Good to know. I thought it was gonna have red borders uh, or uh, a white border. Wow. Or wait, is that yeah? That's all of them. That's cool. Let's look at that back design. Here, let me bring it up like that. Oh, my hands are in the way. Sorry. I'll hold it like this. Pretty cool, huh? That's neat. Wow. Uh, and standard stock feels, classic stock feels so good. Oh, nice, nice, double nice. I love bold like this. So simple, so bold. Like this could be all the way across the table and you would know what it is. That's what I love about it. Uh, put those out. Okay, let's not go through those yet. Oh, let's look at the ad cards. You get a blank. So if you want to do some magic tricks, that's cool. Oh, and a double. Nice. So it's you could do magic and and this is a pretty deck for cardistry, in my opinion. Um, let's do it. I'm gonna do a fan first. And don't if I shuffle, they're not in in uh, mnemonica. Look at that. What? This is now my favorite deck, only because it looks good when I fan. <laughs> You know I can't fan. But look at that. That's a good fan. What? Hello. All right. It's cool. So they fan good. Um, let's see what this is. Yeah, it's just standard stock. Feels good. It, it's, you know, there's, you can't, you can't beat it with the classic stock. Uh, it's so good. It's just standard good stock. All right. So I'm assuming they're like this. Yeah. The Ace of Spades looks fantastic. Look at that. Boom. Good job. Boom, good job. Boom, good job. This is so good. They're incredibly elaborate, more elaborate than I expected. And you got the sparrows on all of them. Yeah, and it's really simple art, you know? That's what the, if you look, if you look at the Hanafuda cards, that's kind of what it's like. Um, very simple, you know? The boar, the sparrow, look at that. That's so cool. Nice. I'm gonna go through the whole deck so y'all could see it all. Um, but I'm lo oh look at that. That's cool. <laughs> that's my card right there. <laughs> oh wow, that's neat. Kind of moody. You know that's that's one of the things. You know there's a lot of mood in these. It's rain in there. That's why I said or it, yeah. Anyways, look at that. Okay, cool. Um, nice. I'm digging these. Um, that's really classy. Well, five of spades there. Um, and I wonder if you could play Hanafuda with these. Do y'all know? Oh my, look at that. Um, I don't know if you can play Hanafuda with these. That's something we should find out. I don't know, but, uh, it, it looks like you can. Cause we're seeing a lot of like, um, duplicates. Um, it's not just the, the, a standard deck of cards. I like it when cards do that, by the way, when they have multiple uses, uh, not just cardistry, um, not just magic. Although the, not, the, the just magic ones are kind of cool cause, um, they make you look good. <laughs> I'm just playing. Oh yeah. It looks like you can play. There's the banners, right? And those are, you'll see these a lot here. See? There's a banner there. Here's one here. So I'm I'm maybe I'm assuming you can play Hanafuda with these. I don't know or, or uh, some kind of games with the ha like Hanafuda that the cards do. I'm going too fast there. Sorry. Um, I don't. There's I don't even know. Some people have commented on some of the games and I've been meaning to look into it uh, to play to learn how to play some. Uh, but you know how time is. Look at that. I'm going to have to say my favorite one is the Ace of Spades. And then that other one with the sun. That one. These two are my favorite. Nice. Really cool. And they handle really well. I can already tell. They're classic stock. So these cards are, as they say, A+. plus. Look at that. And you can tell by, look, just the dribble. Like, they're just good cards. Bicycle makes them good. I'm gonna, okay, I'm gonna break it. Yeah, and they feral, fantastic. And they look good on the back. Look at that, you could do some cardistry. Oh, 
Well, if you're not like me, but if you're good at cardistry, you can do some cardistry. And let's see. They're very, very new. So they're very like, they're almost as hard as standard. Oh, don't drop them. Oh, yes. Can I do it? Can I finish it? Oh, I couldn't. Yeah, the, the, I like it when I break in a deck because it moves, <laughs> moves like that. Don't, don't make you look silly. Yeah, this is a good, good deck. I, I'm impressed. This uh, I know that they make a bunch, um, and this is this is probably I have some other ones by Playing Cards um, that they've printed. This is my favorite one you've done though that you've advertised. PlayingCards.com. PlayingCardDecks.com. Sorry, I always say it wrong. Uh, and I buy from them a lot. I have like a few uh, places I buy from. A lot I buy from SoCal. I buy, buy from Playing Card. And I buy from um, Decks on Decks. Um, there's quite a few other places. Bam. I've never ordered from Bam, though. I don't, think. I don't know. I get kind of eBay. Anyways, I'm blabbing. But yeah, these cards, I recommend this deck. And it's not too bad. I think it's like, I oh, and I, you know, I saw it go up in price. So it might be bad now. It might be more expensive now. But I'm sure they printed a ton. Oh, I see. Okay, cool. That's the video. Thanks for watching. Uh, Sparrow Hanafuda. Um, fusion playing card. So I'm assuming that you can play Hanafuda with these. I'm assuming. If y'all know, let me know. Uh, limited edition, too. So just be on the lookout. That's the review. Thanks for watching. God bless all of you. And I'll see you in the next one. Cheers. Cheers.